Hi friends, I am Professor Prabhakar V. Varde uh, from Bhava Atomic Research Center and of course I was associated with the Homi Bhava National Institute. My area of specialization is uh, uh, nuclear risk and safety assessment and that's how I wrote one book on risk-based engineering and this course is basically on this uh, various chapters of this book. Um, so, uh, the question is uh, why one should take this course? Uh, say a simple reason. Uh, this is a risk-based engineering is an interdisciplinary subject. Whether it is mechanical engineering, electronic engineering or structural engineering, it touches all the aspects. In fact, risk is inher inherent component of the life. So, it's not only engineering, but it is any business that we do, uh, we have to uh, we have to take care of risk, you have to uh, esti estimate whether at qualitative level or at quantitative level, but we should have an assessment of risk. And finally, risk is very closely related to success. So, more risk taking capability means more success. Now, this course has been designed in a manner uh, that, uh, you know, we can uh, postulate uh, the uh, various uh, failure or deviations in a manner that we can prepare the protection algorithm or protection plans. And uh, uh, that's why we have these uh, subjects like uh, prob probability theory and then we go to the reliability and uh, then we go on to the uh, various uh, subjects. These are uh, risk reliability, these are the core, core subjects. But then some advanced subject like uh, prognostics and health management, uh, many of you would not have heard about it. Uh, for major accidents, it is the uh, human factor that is responsible. So that means human factor modeling uh, requires huge resources. And th these type of courses, including prognostics and health management, physics of failure, is a new, physics of failure is a new pro, uh, uh, paradigm in reliability engineering because uh, one, the traditional paradigm is based on the frequency, but we want time to failure. Then if we know that, we can plan in our life, we can plan our equipment, we can uh, do many jobs. So there is a learning for any business we, we can call, but if it is for engineering, um, you will do well if we uh, take this as a course and uh, you know, uh, we can benefit all. Uh, as far as my background is concerned, um, I have uh, I have uh, last 35 years I have been working in this area. You know that nuclear industry is one of the safest industry. Um, they have demonstrated record of safety. And how we do that? Probably uh, you will hear not only the academics, but you will hear about the experience also, which is very important. So you know, this, in this lecture, I have, I have ensured that uh, we have avoided to the extent possible mathematics and but then wherever necessary but then the experience also goes on uh, while uh, taking up this course. So whether it is graduate level even though it has been designed for research scholars and uh, risk and reliability professional so it is meant for all the engineers who want to do their business in a more effective manner. So uh, there are 12 modules and uh, uh, so 12 weeks uh, course but uh, you will learn uh, many dimensions of uh, safety and risk over here in this course. So I, I invite all of you to take up this course. Thank you very much.